Frustrated Covington residents are making their voices heard after recent rains caused sewage to flood into their homes. Not on your sides. Mariel Carbone is live at Covington City Hall. Mariel. Well, typically tonight uh, at these caucus meetings, they don't normally take public comment, but because so many residents came out upset about what they were experiencing for the floods, the commission did set aside about 10 minutes at the beginning of its meeting to hear from those residents. Now, some of the concerns that these people brought up. First off, who's going to pay for this? A lot of the residents are out thousands of dollars because of damage from this sewer over overflow that flooded in their basements. Another big question is just who to turn to. Uh, because they say that they're getting the runaround. The city is sending them to SD1. SD1 is sending them back to the city. So really, they're just asking tonight where to go to next. Take a listen to what some had to say. We as a neighborhood feel abandoned. I feel like I'm paranoid now. All I want is just somebody to help me get my home fixed. And the commission not even really able to respond to those residents tonight. The mayor saying that this isn't an opportunity for dialogue, so they weren't interacting and uh, really engaging with those residents. He says that will happen at the next meeting, uh, but he does say that they don't have the answers to these problems right now, but that they are committed to finding a long term solution. I'll have more on that coming up at 11 tonight, but for now reporting live in Covington, Marielle Carbone nine on your side.